Okay, so we have an expression which is 2a minus, and then parenthesis, b plus c minus 3a. They tell me that a is negative 3, b is negative 1, and c is 1 half. So I'm going to go ahead and the first step is to, um, you know, get rid of the parentheses. So I have 2a negative times positive, so negative b, negative times positive, negative c, minus 3a. Now I can go ahead and substitute. For a, I have negative 3. So 2 times negative 3, and then minus, see how every single one I need to respect the sign. Minus 1 half, minus 3 times negative 3. Now I can go ahead and do 2 times negative 3 is negative 6. Negative times negative is plus 1, minus 1 half. Negative 3 times negative 3 is going to be equals to 9. Awesome, I'm almost done. Negative 6 plus 1 plus 9. Well, the first thing that I want to do is just to mix the positive first. So 1 plus 9 is going to be equals to 10. Okay, and then I have 10 minus 6 minus 1 half. Well, let's go ahead and do this fraction here. I'm going to go ahead and put a 1 here. I don't have the same denominator, so I put a 2 on the top and a 2 on the bottom. So I have negative 6 and 2 is equals to 12. So I have 10 minus 12 over 2 minus 1 half. Remember, I'm just doing this fraction. Now I have the same denominator. Negative 12 minus 1 is actually negative 13. I keep the same denominator. I'm almost done. 10 minus 13 over 2. Finally, I can go ahead and say 10 over 1 minus 13 over 2. I go ahead and put the same denominator again, and I get that 20 minus 13 all divided by 2 is equals to 7 over 2. I can also write this answer as I put a 2, 3, and 1 because look, 3 times 2, 6 plus 1, 7. 3, 1 half, and that's it.